The online tennis world is thriving at the moment due to the pandemic and the advancements in technology, which is great news for tennis players, tennis parents and tennis coaches that are looking to increase their knowledge. However, if you don't know what you're looking for, it can be a minefield out there. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you some of my favorite tennis YouTube channels, which have either benefited me as a tennis coach, or I feel they'll benefit you as a tennis player or a tennis parent. And if you hang around to the end of the video, I'll share with you a couple of my favorite Instagram accounts as well. Let's check them out. So before I get into my favorite channels, none of them know that I'm going to be making this video and they may not even see it. So if you already subscribe to their channels or follow their Instagram accounts, let them know. And if you become a subscriber or a follower off the back of this video, let them know where you came from. I obviously can go through every single tennis channel. So if there are any really good ones that you feel that I've missed, let me know in the comments below. And if I like them, I may feature them in a future video. So in no particular order, the first channel on my list is My Tennis HQ. Now this channel is run by a professional tennis player called Carousel. He's a Brazilian tennis player who's had a career high ATP ranking of 371, but I believe he was in the top 50 as a junior. The reason I really like this channel is Caru seems to be a genuine down to earth guy. Lots of his videos are of him hitting, whether it be with a professional tennis player, he's been a hitting partner with Naomi Osaka a few times, but also he posts videos of him hitting with his own players that he's working with. Sometimes it's within practice sets, sometimes it's within coaching sessions. But what's really nice is he commentates throughout the hits whether he's talking about his feelings and strategy during a practice set, or whether he's talking through his routines during his warm up and his practice sessions. But it gives you really good insights into the mind of a professional tennis player. Some of his videos are even filmed in point of view format where he's actually got a GoPro in his mouth so you can see really good angle of how he's hitting the ball. He's a fantastic tennis player, so it's a really good channel for you to watch whether you're a tennis player, a parent or even a coach. The next channel that I recommend is Tennis Brothers. Now, Tennis Brothers is run by a pair of brothers, obviously, called Felix and Lucian. Felix is getting ready to go to university, and Lucian, his younger brother, is chasing his first ITF point. The brothers have been running this channel for a number of years now, and it's been amazing to see their journey from young teens all the way through to today. Their channel features lots of videos from training days, fitness regimes, practice sets against world-ranked players, and also various product reviews. It's a great channel to watch if you're a young aspiring player or if you're a tennis parent as they really take you through their journey and what it's like at the top end of junior tennis. Felix recently went out to Patrick Moratoglu's academy in France and he shows you what it's like behind the scenes. Again, both of them are fantastic tennis players and speak really well to camera as well. So a really easy watch and definitely a channel that I'd recommend. The next channel that I'm featuring in this video is Tennis Nerd. Now, Tennis Nerd is run by a guy called Jonas. I'd probably say that he's the most well-known tennis equipment reviewer online. His channel is dedicated to reviewing tennis equipment, whether it be rackets, strings, grips. So if you're looking to upgrade your racket or you're looking to use some different strings, he's definitely a good one to follow. Most of his reviews show him hitting with a partner and he goes into lots of depth in talking about the specs of each racket. So if you're a bit of a tennis nerd like myself and Jonas, it's definitely a channel to watch. I've actually not done any racket reviews on this channel, but Jonas has inspired me to do so. So hopefully in the next couple of months, I'll be making a review on the new head boom and comparing it to my head speed. So let me know in the comments below if that's something that would interest you. So we've got three more channels left. The next one is Essential Tennis. Now, I've got to say Essential Tennis is probably the main reason why I started a YouTube channel myself. Ian Westerman has run this channel for a number of years now, one of the biggest tennis YouTube channels out there. And the reason why I really warmed to Ian and his videos is just his genuine passion for tennis. Ian's videos are generally aimed at club adult players. However, the simple and effective teaching points that he gives the players are transferable across all ages and abilities. Not only do Ian and his team deliver really good tennis lessons and tutorials, but you can also follow his journey as a tennis coach and as a YouTuber. I've been inspired by the way that he presents his lessons using a smart whiteboard and video analysis. And it's been really interesting to see the ups and downs in his career. Unfortunately, recently he's lost the facility that he was working at. But what was really nice to see was all of his YouTube community getting behind him, helping to support him. And he's actually managed to find a new indoor center, which he's gonna be working at moving forwards. So if you're an adult tennis player that's looking to improve your game, Essential Tennis is a fantastic channel to follow and a great community to be a part of. The next channel that I'm going to talk about is called Foot Dr. Zach. Now, I came across this channel when I started my channel over a year ago. I was in the process of buying some new tennis trainers and wanted to have a comparison between two pairs of shoes. Went straight onto Google, typed it in, and the first video that popped up was Foot Dr. Zach. This channel is dedicated to shoe reviews. Now, Zach is a foot doctor and a passionate tennis player. 
and his videos go into more depth than any other shoe review that I've seen. He'll unbox a shoe, take it for a test run, and really go into depth when it comes to how the shoe suits different foot types. Lots of his videos compare two shoes like for like, but he also does something that I've not seen before, where he actually tears down a pair of shoes. He'll cut them in half and really look into the materials that the shoes are made from and how that affects the performance. So if you're looking for a new pair of trainers or you're just intrigued by this sort of thing, head over to his channel. So just before I get into the last recommendation, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. And if you're enjoying this video, hit the like button as well. So the final channel is a new one on YouTube, but it's much, much bigger over on Instagram. And it's Patrick Moratoglu's channel. So if you don't know, Patrick Moratoglu is probably one of the most famous tennis coaches in the world at the moment. He's known for coaching Serena Williams and Stefanos Tsitsipas, along with Marcos Bagdatis. And he runs one of the biggest academies in the world, the Moratoglu Tennis Academy in Nice, France. Now what I like about Patrick's videos, not only are they set in the incredible environment of his academy, but most of them show him coaching a junior player of a very good standard and him breaking down some very complex techniques into language that anyone can understand. His passion and enthusiasm for the game really shine through, inspiring anybody that's watching them. So although his channel on YouTube is a new one, I'm pretty sure it's going to blow up quite quickly. This channel is a really good one for anyone in the tennis world, whether you're a player, parent or coach. So as promised, I've actually got two more tennis coaches that I've been following for a while now. Both of these are on Instagram. The first one is Micah Babbel. Now Micah is an ex-professional tennis player from Germany. She actually made it into the top 30 in the world WTA and has played in 19 Grand Slam tournaments. Micah shares lots of experiences from her days on the tour, but also tons of tennis tips that can help players of all levels. Now, although Micah is primarily over on Instagram, she's actually started a YouTube channel as well. So go head over and subscribe to that channel too. But what I love about Micah's channel is the fact that she's played to such a high level. She's got so many experiences to share. Now, just because you're a fantastic tennis player does not mean that you're going to be a fantastic coach. But also there are lots of fantastic coaches out there that aren't fantastic players. It's actually quite rare to find somebody that can do both, but Micah is certainly one of those. My final recommendation is to head over to Joel Myers Tennis over on Instagram and give him a follow. He's got to be one of my favourite Instagram accounts. Joel is an Aussie coach running an academy out in the States. He posts tons of content every single week, giving coaches drill ideas, giving players technical tips and tactical tips, and his technical knowledge is second to none. So if you're over on Instagram and you're looking for some coaches to follow, Micah Babel and John Myers Tennis are two fantastic ones where you can't go wrong. So there you go. They were six of my favorite YouTube channels and two of my favorite Instagram accounts for you to go and check out. If they were new to you, head over and let them know where you came from. And if you've got any other suggestions of great channels or accounts to follow, let me know in the comments below. And if I like their channels, I'll feature them in another video. Thanks as always for watching. I'll see you in next week's video.